Hey everybody, I am 22 Tiger Dude and I am here to review the animated film Escape from Planet Earth. This movie is about when Rob Corddry versus this blue alien, he helps his brother, voiced by Brendan Fraser, you know, just uh, what to do during all of his missions. But then one day they get into this little fight, Rob Corddry's character is fired from work. Brendan Fraser's character gets into a trap and he's kidnapped. So now it's up to Rob Corddry's character to go into Earth to save his brother. He meets his friends along the way. Going into Escape from Planet Earth, oh my god, I was not looking forward to this film. I was seriously dreading this animation film. I love animation films. It's actually one of my favorite genres in filmmaking. I just adore animation films. That's why I have this baby and this baby right here. These are two posters to prove that I am a true animation fan. This film, I wait until Netflix to see it, and after seeing this film, thank you, God that I did not see this film in theaters. Escape from Planet Earth is not a bad film. It's not an awful film. It is a horrendous film. Oh! Before I get into any more details why I just hate this film so much, let me tell you exactly who is in this film. Brendan Fraser. Why? Rob Cordry, why? Ricky Gervais, why? Jessica Alba, no, no, not one of the hottest actresses of all time. Gosh, she is so freaking hot, but she is in this piece of shit. Sofia Vergara, eh. Sarah Jessica Parker, never cared for her. And there's a few more. Oh yeah, George Lopez, Craig Robinson, Jane Lynch. I'm not gonna lie, I know some people hate George Lopez, but believe it or not, I'm a fan of George Lopez and I still am right now. The storyline is very cliched. It's very predictable. Like, I am not kidding you. I am fine with cliches as long as it's not too predictable, and they try to make something refreshing out of it. There is nothing creative or inspiring about this freaking piece of shit. I am not joking with you. The storyline is just so generic. Every line you've heard in other films before, every situation that has happened, it's been done before. And plus, I felt like they ripped off the idea from Planet 51, which I actually like that film. I like that film. The storyline is different from Planet 51, I will say that. I could tell the whole alien concept. I think they obviously got that from Planet 51. There's a lot of animation films out there that have such imagination, that have such creativity, and they could just blow your mind to take you to a whole different world, while this animation film has none of that. It doesn't give you that wow factor. It's just generic. It offers basically nothing for the older audience to enjoy. Adults are going to be suffering in pain watching Escape from Planet Earth. <sighs> it has sloppy writing. The pacing is fast paced. This film is so freaking fast paced. They rushed scene by scene. One moment without spoiling anything, like if anyone cares. Okay, one moment they're at this spot, the dad and the mom, they're chasing after the kid, and then another 30 seconds later, the kid's at the ship, and then 10 seconds later, the dad gets to the kid. Like, it's all going rush. It's like, boom, 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 boom. The pacing is just too fast paced. They never slow down. The pacing it is just so unbelievable how fast it was. When the film has its dramatic moments, even they rush through the heartfelt and dramatic moments. The animation in this film looks like a direct-to-DVD animation. There's nothing really creative. I mean, on the humans, the animation looks fine. It just looks fine 
on the humans. But on the aliens, it just looks so awful, so cheap, barely any details, if not no details at all, to the animation level. It's just so... I could not stand this film. This is one of the worst films of 2013. They reuse the lines. They reuse uh, situations we've seen over and over again. It's nothing but recycled bullshit shoved up your face. Oh. And the humor is just bland, it's unoriginal, and of course, it's humor you've heard millions and millions of times. For example, are you crying? No, I just got something in my eye. Yeah, we haven't heard that one before, right? <laughs> the only positive I'll give this film is that there were a couple of pretty funny moments. I did laugh twice. That's all I could really give the film. Th those are the only positives to this film. Just two pretty funny moments, and that's it. Please do not see Escape from Planet Earth. For the first time on my channel, I'm going to use my 0 0.5 out of four star rating. I've used my zero out of four star rating before, but not my 0 0.5 out of four. That's why I give Escape from Planet Earth. 0 0.5 out of four stars. Oh my gosh. Subscribe to my channel, comment your opinion on this film, like and share this video, follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I am 22 Tiger Dude. Don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.